It's not surprising that a lot goes into running a theme park, and nowhere is that more true than Disney. From Disneyland's classic rides and sights like the Haunted Mansion and Sleeping Beauty Castle, to flashy new attractions at Walt Disney World like Flight of Passage and Animal Kingdom, it takes a massive effort just to turn the lights on and get guests through the gates at Disney's six American theme parks and two water parks. That's no secret. However, there are a lot of things going on behind the scenes that Disney would rather its guests and fans didn't know. To name a few, Here's the list of top 10 hidden secrets you didn't know about Disney World. Have your pen and paper handy as you may need to write down these items so you won't miss them on your next visit to Disney World. Stick around till number 1 as this fact may really shock you. Number 10. Not all boats float. Surely no one over the age of, say 12, thinks that actual magic happens at Disney World. We adults at least understand that it's all just an elaborate illusion. But it might surprise you to hear about some of the tricks Disney has to pull to maintain the fantasy. Disney World features a number of boat rides. And you probably won't be especially shocked to hear that the boats aren't actual boats. They're on tracks, just like all the other rides. So how does Disney pull off this particular illusion? With dye. The Liberty Bell is the paddle wheel steamship that runs on a river around Tom Sawyer Island. But according to World of Mouse, it needs no captain because it never leaves the track that's hidden just under the surface of the water. To maintain the illusion, the water in the river is dyed green and brown. So guests can't see the track. In fact, the boat needs just about 18 inches of water depth as it proceeds along the track. It's a pretty convincing illusion though, right? Number 9. The Haunted Mansion is Illusion After Illusion If you still want to be fully immersed in the spooks and splendors of the Haunted Mansion, then click away. Not afraid of spoilers? Good! The Haunted Mansion may seem like it's full of eyes that follow you through a room and ghosts that dance and disappear, but it's all just an illusion. For instance, the famous ballroom scene with dozens of ghosts dining and dancing isn't a projection. It's actually a large-scale version of an old funhouse technique called Pepper's Ghost. The sight trick requires two rooms, one that people can see into and a second that's hidden. A sheet of plexiglass is set in the main room at an angle that reflects the view of the hidden room towards the audience, showing real animatronic figures in a ghostly light. The same effect is also used on Pinocchio's daring journey at Disneyland to make the blue fairy glimmer and glisten. Number 8. Epcot City Epcot was meant to be a real city. Ever wonder what Epcot stands for? It's the experimental prototype community of tomorrow. Before he passed away in 1966, Walt Disney's original plan for the East Coast expansion called The Florida Project was to create a utopian city for about 20,000 residents. Epcot would have been a testing bed for city planning, technology, and community. However, after Walt died, the idea of the Disney company founding a city without his guidance was too much. Thus, the permanent world's fair concept of Epcot as we know it today was born with Future World and the World Showcase, with some of the best restaurants at Disney. You can still see Walt's plans for his community of tomorrow on the Magic Kingdom's People Mover, where the original model is on display. Number 7. Smellitizers If you have been to any of Disney's theme parks, you might not have noticed their copious use of these things. Their most obvious application is on certain rides, like Soarin' Around the World, where you can literally smell the flowers and the great outdoors. While standing in line for Pirates of the Caribbean, you might notice the scent of salty sea air. And when you walk down Main Street and smell freshly baked cookies, it's not your imagination. Disney has smellitizers all around the resort to enhance the guest experience. It's not just limited to the parks either. The resort hotel lobbies are also pumped full of scents to bring you back home. Number 6. The Lucky Family Every morning, Magic Kingdom holds a musical opening ceremony known to Disney fans as the Rope Drop. But few guests know that Disney employees 
pick a special family to help open the Magic Kingdom every day. The family of the day gets to take a tour of Main Street before it officially opens for the day and star in the opening ceremonies. Cast members will then escort the family to the Magic Kingdom train station and introduce them to the waiting crowd below. Interested in being selected? Past Family of the Day alumni recommend that families should arrive very early to the Magic Kingdom. Wear matching Disney gear and show enthusiasm. Number 5. Fake Flags Main Street USA may be one of the most all-American destinations you can visit, but look really closely at the American flags throughout the Disney parks. They're all missing a stripe or star, so they're not really American flags. Is it a mistake? Nope, because each flag is fake. Disney doesn't have to follow American flag regulations, such as flying flags at half-mast during certain situations or shining lights on them during the night. There is one real flag at the front of Main Street at both Disneyland and Walt Disney's World's Magic Kingdom, and the parks hold a flag retreat daily. Number 4. Ashes of Dead People over the years, Disney cast members and custodians have had to deal with multiple guests smuggling the ashes of their loved ones and scattering them somewhere around or inside the Haunted Mansion attraction. According to the LA Times, this actually happens at the Haunted Mansions in both California's Disneyland and Florida's Disney World. The attraction's macabre graveyard-esque landscape certainly looks like an opportune place for a person to leave the ashes of a loved one but Disney's staff advises against it, even more so for those who try to scatter the ashes somewhere within the building or during the ride itself. You know what usually happens afterwards? You get kicked out, and the ride gets stopped until custodians vacuum up your loved one's remains, just so they can be dumped out with the soda cups, empty popcorn boxes, and the rest of the trash. Scatter those ashes somewhere else, Haunted Mansion needs a Ghostbuster, not a Dustbuster. Number 3. Complaints equals free money. Now, we aren't encouraging getting anyone into trouble or moaning unjustly. However, if you have genuinely been wronged, a complaint could bag you some free Disney dollars. This currency will allow you to buy food and ride fares on the site. It's said that Disney has a large budget to account for these sorts of handouts. For those who are polite and civil, of course, customer satisfaction is of huge priority to Disney, so you'll often be compensated generously. If for whatever reason you would prefer something different to Disney dollars, such as a toy, just ask. Though remember you could always use your dollars to choose your own toys. Bear in mind to approach an employee that is not in character, as they will be able to help you much more efficiently. Plus, where would Mickey Mouse store his wallet full of dollars? Number 2. Club 33 Did you know that Walt Disney World has its own private members club and the locations are hiding in plain sight? It's called Club 33, and it's a spin-off of Disneyland's hollowed version. Only here, each theme park has its own unique take. Epcot's is located above the American Adventure, Magic Kingdom's is to the right of the Adventureland entrance, and Disney Hollywood Studios operates one on the second floor of the Hollywood Brown Derby restaurant, with a fourth being built at Disney's Animal Kingdom. All four offer a theme honoring a different aspect of Walt Disney's life and travels. You can get nary a peek inside without a member, but know the spaces are impeccably decorated with plenty of nods to the man who started it all. Right down to a Nautilus-themed bar in Magic Kingdom's version that pays tribute to the early Disney film, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. Number 1. Cinderella's Secret Room Most Disney fans are aware that there's a secret room hidden inside Cinderella Castle. But given that you can't book a night or even beg your way in, only a lucky few are allowed to see what's inside. Located through a nondescript door within the castle is a lobby lined with tapestries where guests board an elevator to be whisked up to the suite. Its foyer, which features a glass slipper and crown on display, 
cells from the original animated film on the walls, and a tiled floor mosaic of the princess's gilded carriage on the floor, sets the scene for a true bedroom tucked within Walt Disney World's stunning tower. The mystical room is breathtaking. The view, although somewhat obscured, is unparalleled. But it's the details that are never discussed, including marble columns with Cinderella's mice etched into the top, and an antique desk that's hundreds of years old that surprises and wows. There's even a royal bath chamber with a starry sky over the tub, proving it's truly fit for royalty. How many of these do you already know? Which fact makes you more interested about visiting Disney World? Or do you have anything in mind that should be in this list? Let us know in the comments! Please like, share, and subscribe for more interesting videos!